Welcome to TV 11 News. Medtronic, the global leader in medical technology, inaugurated its new global IT or GIT center at Medtronic Engineering and Innovation Center or MEIC in Hyderabad today in the presence of Honorable Minister for IT, Industries and Commerce, Government of Telangana, Mr. D. Sridhar Babu and U.S. Council General, Ms. Jennifer Larson, along with senior leaders from Medtronic including Ms. Rashmi Kumar, SVP and CIO Global, Medtronic and Mr. Divyaprakash Joshi, Vice President and Site Leader of MEIC. Global IT Center is Medtronic's first large-scale IT center outside of the U.S. The company will be investing $60 million, which will support in creating 300 new job opportunities over the next three to five years. GIT will also focus on cutting-edge technologies such as cloud engineering, data platforms, digital health applications, hyper-automation, and AI and ML. The talent competencies include cloud and DevOps, advanced analytics and visualization, integration and middleware, full-stack engineering, robotic process automation, process and data mining, agile program management, process excellence and business analysis along with IT security and compliance. Through these competencies, the new GIT center will boost productivity, manage risks and drive growth in the healthcare technology. Speaking at the inauguration event, Honorable Minister for IT, Industries and Commerce, Government of Telangana, Mr. D. Sridhar Babu said that he was delighted that Medtronic is growing by leaps and bounds from Hyderabad. He had the pleasure of inaugurating MEIC's expanded R&D facility in February this year and during this time, he had discussed about various other technological opportunities. In about five months, they are here to launch Medtronic's new global IT center. Reputed firms like Medtronic choosing to double down on their existing investments in Telangana underscores the vibrant innovation ecosystem that is being nurtured here. This is a glowing testament to the government's progressive and innovative policies. He also said that they remain committed to the growth of medical technology sector and we will extend every bit of support from the government. Rashmi Kumar, SVP and CIO from Medtronic said, and I quote unquote, innovation is at the heart of every transformative technology at Medtronics. The inauguration of our global IT center in India is a testament to our commitment to strengthening global technology capabilities. We extend our gratitude to the government of Telangana for fostering a vibrant innovation ecosystem. The launch of the center reiterates our commitment to Indian market and propels us towards impacting more patient lives and advancing healthcare technology. India offers one of the best talent pools for IT and we look forward to leveraging the skill set to support the growth of healthcare technology, thereby positively impacting the patient lives. Speaking on this occasion, Mr. Divya Joshi, the Vice President and MEIC Site Leader Medtronic said, the inauguration of the GIT Center at the MEIC facility in Hyderabad marks a transformative step for Medtronic. By establishing our first large-scale IT capability center outside the U.S., we are not only investing in advanced technologies but also in the rich talent pool that India has to offer. This new center will be pivotal in supporting innovations, enhancing our global IT capabilities and delivering top-notch tech-driven healthcare solutions. We are excited to contribute to Hyderabad's dynamic tech ecosystem. The center places a strong emphasis on talent, focusing on skill enhancement, inclusivity and workforce diversity. Initiatives such as Women in IT or WIT as we call it are designed to support and mentor women in technical positions while employee resource groups like ERGs will continue to offer opportunities for professional development, networking and engagement. Let's take a look at this detailed report by TV11 News and if you haven't already, please follow TV11 News Live by subscribing to us on YouTube, like and comment on this video and follow TV11 News Live on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter.